that was your first full game for Chelsea City in yeah. the league and uh, first clean sheet for us this season. Is that a coincidence? <laughs> no, I think we just worked hard as a team today, you know. It might have been a bit of bit of inspiration for the lads that a few lads were back, but no, I think we just worked hard as a team. Yeah. And how important was the result overall in, in the context? Oh, it's massive, you know, for, for both teams really, you know. We've, we both haven't, you know, haven't won a game for sort of three or four. So obviously a win for either team was massive and unfortunately for them it didn't go for them, but you know, plus side for us, hopefully this starts us on a winning roll now. Yeah, you say then, that must have been quite strange, bearing in mind you were yeah. the player of the year there last year, or is it a it strange is, lined up against them? It is strange, yeah. Yeah, you know, obviously a lot of the lads and my mates as well and you know, a lot of back, back staff and Steve Castle, you know, still keep in touch with, so it is strange, but you know, we all move on and and here I am at Chelmsford, so. Yeah. And do you think we can build on today's result? Definitely. You know, it's, in a way, it's, it's good we've got two days. Hopefully that gives us the confidence to go into the uh, it's Lewis, isn't it? Yeah, Let's get this right. <laughs> yeah, the Lewis game, you know, another home game as well. So hopefully, you know, we've got a, a win in front of our own fans. So they'll spur us on again for another three points. And last but not least, how is your, your injury? You uh, had a groin injury. How's that? How's that? <laughs> the groin's all right. It's just me, me lungs. I need a new pair of lungs after about 20 minutes. But no, nah, no, nah, I'm all right. I'm OK. So I've had done all the right rehab and stuff, so have a nice rest now and hopefully build on for me and, like I say, play Monday and get another another win. So all in all, the atmosphere in the dressing room will be good tonight? Yeah, yeah, we've won. You know, beats lose. So Glenn, 2-0, um, you're pleased to put an end to that ball run? Oh yeah, without a doubt. I mean, it was, uh, it was important we did that. Obviously a lot have been made of it. Um, you know, it's been well documented what uh, sort of everybody felt, and uh, we, we was disappointed with ourselves and, and frustrated because you know we, we felt we wasn't you know playing too badly. Although the, the, the defeat at Newport was dreadful, the rest of the games was you know we was you know and we should have got something out of them if it wasn't for silly mistakes. And uh, you know the boys have worked really hard and they've taken a lot of things on board. Uh, they've taken the criticism and, and the criticism was due. I mean it wasn't you know just any old criticism. It was said in the right manner and, and they've, as I say they've taken it on board and I thought that was excellent today and football's all about making the right decisions and uh, we made a lot more right ones today than we have been doing which is great and obviously the, the conclusion is you keep a clean sheet and you win a football match which is brilliant. And you had a few decisions of your, to make of your own, um, there was a, a lot of players available for you today, was it good to have a full squad to choose from? Um, yeah so pleasing obviously I mean we're still without Simon and Ollie so you know they're still two big players for us Simon Glover and Ollie Bequez but uh, to have uh, Danny back um, who is obviously a proven goal scorer at this level um, and, and Ben Martin who's a, a, a massive part of what we're trying to build here uh, in more ways than one um, and that proved that today it was, a, it was a great bonus to have them back and I think you can see from the team performance today how important key players are to you and um, they, they certainly both played a, a, a big part in what was a good team performance. It would have been important to get that, that first clean shoot under your belt today. Was that um, something that you looked forward to? Yeah, I think it was, uh, it was a bit of a bit of a stigma for us really. You know, we was, we was desperately wanting clean sheets. We spoke about them all pre-season and, and come into the season and, and go that amount of games without getting one. So we, we know how important you've got, to, you've got to keep clean sheets to win leagues. Uh, you know, to be successful, and, and we want to be that, and that's the first one, hopefully, of many today. Um, as I say, you know, the, the, the back four, if they if they start making them right decisions, which they have done today, and and they protect the goal like they did today, then I mean, again, I think I, I've watched DVDs from the, the three two one defeats we've had, and uh, apart from picking the ball out of his net for the goals, Craig hasn't had to make a save really, and it's the same again today. He's made one great decision with a punch towards the end of the game. But other than that, I mean, I've just spoken to him and he hasn't had to make a save today, which is great. You want that. You want your goalkeeper and your goal protected. And, uh, you know, pat on the back. They've had enough criticism over the last week or so. So pats on the back for the back four today, or the whole team, really. Yeah. So all in all, plenty to uh, build on for the, for the big game against Lewis on Monday night? Yeah, one swallow doesn't make a summer. As I was told when I first started in football, and they're absolutely right. You know, it's about uh, a whole season and building on that. But that's, that's a good start. As you said, a clean sheet. Uh, a victory, two goals. Please for Antonio Murray to get off the mark. So important for a striker to get his first goal. And uh, obviously Robbie coming on and, you know, he's, a, he's so potent, Robbie. I mean, he's such a big threat to people with the, with the size of him and he's got great feet uh, for a big fella. And I know that'll be said time and time again to him, but he really has. And, um, and with young Ricky Modeste learning the game up front, he, he's going to be another bonus for us. You know, he's come on and done ever so well again today.